I am Sumiko. I lived on a carnation farm with my family, my little brother Doc Doc, my aunts, uncles, and grandfather, who came to America from Japan. Being Japanese American, I did not always fit in with my classmates, but I had a dream of one day owning my very own flower shop. That is, until. Yesterday, December 7th, 1941, a date which will live in infamy, the United States of America was suddenly and deliberately attacked by naval and air forces of the Empire of Japan. After the bombing of Pearl Harbor by my native people, non-Japanese Americans began to suspect that all Japanese people were spies and terrorists. To protect us, the American government put us on trains with only what we could carry, forcing us to leave behind everything we knew to live in an internment camp on a Native American reservation in Poston, Arizona, where dust storms regularly choke the sky and seep into every crack of the military barracks where we live. Just when I thought things couldn't get worse, my cousins joined the American Army. Read my story by Cynthia Karahata to find out if I make it through the camp to see the weed flowers once again.